Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Jennifer. In this video, I'm going to be trying out the Restorer. I'm friends with the inventor and he was kind enough to send the tool and all of the replacement rollers. Many of my Instagram peers have the Restorer already and have spoken very highly about its capabilities. I love furniture flips and saving older pieces from the landfill, so this is perfect for that purpose because it quickly removes material. The Restorer can be used to refinish and repurpose wood, metal, concrete, and fiberglass for new projects or to reinvigorate an old project. This is a must have for anyone that works with reclaimed wood or salvaged lumber, auto restoration and metal prep, concrete polishing and brick cleaning, wood sculpting and carving, which is something I would love to do someday, or refinishing metal and cleaning glass. You don't need a tool to change accessories, which I should note, there are 16 to choose from, and debris is collected through the dust port and into a shop vac. What makes this tool different than an average sander is the ability to evenly distribute pressure across the surface while providing better control and reducing strain on your wrists and your hands. A few things to point out about this tool, it has soft grip handles for comfort, a variable speed dial for touch-ups or total renovations, a quick release for easy roller change, a lock-on switch to maintain power during use. To turn the machine on, you just pull the trigger and it automatically goes off when you take your finger off. But if you do both of these at the same time, then that engages that lock, which will keep this running. And when you pull the trigger, it turns back off. Here are a few of the specs. It has a brushed 3.5 amp motor, 420 watts, and 120 volts. The dust port is an inch and a quarter in diameter. The cord is eight feet, and the shaft size is 12 millimeter. It weighs four and a half pounds, and it measures about six and a quarter inches high, 6.59 inches wide, and 12.72 inches long. The max RPM is 3,200, and the minimum RPM is 1,000. It's ULCSA and ETL safety listed. I like that 80% of the sanding roller is actually covered within the housing. Versus some of the other belt sanders that I have, it seems a bit safer to me, not only in potentially getting something like your clothing caught in the tool, but also it seems like more of the debris would be directed through the dust port versus airborne. You can use this with one or two hands, depending on the job, and it's best not to push down on the tool, just let it do its work. You can use this on vertical surface, say for instance, you're working on taking the paint off of a fence, or you can use it flat on pieces that are horizontal on your workbench. It's best to move the restorer back and forth evenly and consistently. That will give you the best uniform results. This is the nylon abrasive bristle wheel with 80 grit. This one is the sandpaper profile flap wheel with 120 grit. Stainless steel wheel. This is for textured wood and polished metals. Ooh, look at that. That obviously would be the side that goes down into the shaft. The starter kit comes with 260, 80, and 120 grit sanding sleeves. reminders here's the before and after a couple minutes and I could still if I wanted to do more beyond this video I could spend more time but that should give you a pretty good illustration on what can happen within a couple of minutes it's starting to come back to life if you're interested in purchasing this product it is available through my Amazon shop which I'll link in the description of this video also if you'd like to purchase it directly through the restorer website you can use my coupon code Jen Klein 10 and that will save you 10% off. Prices range from about $129 up to about $880 for the everything kit. The tool does come with a three-year warranty. If you have any questions, please leave them for me in the comments. 
And also don't forget to subscribe and like this video here on YouTube as well. I'm also on TikTok, Instagram, and Facebook. Please find me there too. As always, thank you so much for watching and until next time, take care.